All right, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Uh, welcome back to Final Fantasy IV. We're mid-deep or knee-deep into the uh, trial of, what is this, trial of what? Trial of, cave of trials, all right. Okay, so let's continue forward. Go west. Some vampire bats and a vampiress. We need some heat. Uh, I don't know why I did that, but we'll do it. Whatever. Eventually, we're going to have some bad guys here. Um, or bosses, I mean. I mean, technically, we already have bad guys. We're fighting them. Your defense sucks, uh, Sid. Right. Should be a siren. Okay. Go up the stairs we pass. Okay. Um, that was a lot of bad guys. That was two of those trees. Those red trees from um, the Fey March thing. That was a Marlboro and something else. Um, yeah, that, that, that kind of sucked. I wasn't ready. Um, if I would have been ready, that wouldn't have affected me like it did, but oops. Soon, uh. What are you? A remedy, yeah, the, that. I hate those guys. That was four more evil dreamers. I absolutely hate the evil dreamers. They are they are nightmarish on just a stupid level. Okay. That was four more evil dreamers. That was two Belphegors. Robe of Lords. Okay. Take it. And then it ups my defense as a plus. So now we go down the stairs. And we get a Sage's robe. Let me guess. That's for the other one, right? That is for Palom. That is correct. Oh, yeah. Okay. Cool, 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 cool. All right. Ah, nope, right here. We are on now floor six. Move all the way up and go up the stairs. Oop, you know, two fell knights and two mini centenas. So the bad guys are getting harder. Oh, I don't know who fought these guys. Um, ouch. Do I have a wake? Do we? You don't have a rise. Cry up. You have rays, so that'll work. Hitting you with Bazaga, let's do it. Really? Okay.
Can't keep Cecil alive to save my life over here. Bio is such a dangerous move. It didn't do anything here. All right, hit him with another tornado. Yeah, tornado is really good for these guys, I think. Tornado is good for a lot of bad guys if you hit them right. Do you not have tornado on my tripping? We just need to hit those guys with tornado. Yeah. It's two Belphegors. That was a lot of bad guys I didn't feel like fighting. Got a fork now. Let's see. Wait, 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 wait. All right, I was a couple elder treants and a. And a, um, damn it, uh, Marvel, obviously. Seriously. That was two Fell Knights and four Mini Sentanas. I didn't feel like fighting them. What do we got? We got a Grand Helm, which is for Mr. S no. Mr. Sid. Okay, yeah, we definitely need defense, because boy. That was Summoner. We don't know what he summoned, because he died before he got a chance. Grand Armor. Is that for him as well? That's also for him. Perfection. Okay, now what? Mm-hmm. That was two more Elder Treants and uh, two Marbles. I don't like fighting them, so I don't. I'm picking my fights now because this is a this is a hard part. That was another summoner that didn't get to summon. That was a summoner that summoned a area a, a Raj, a, Arachne. That's it. Okay, let me make sure Elphagors again. Alright, got to dry either. Now we're going to go to B7. We're almost done with the first, well, maybe not the first round completely, but... Alright, now we're going to B7, travel north, but don't go up the stairs. There are two sets. One left and one uh, to the right. Take Each will take you to treasure chest, so... Mega Elixir. That was three Evil Dreamers and two e uh, Senior Treants, or whatever they're called. Sorry guys, that was actually a, um, that was actually a great Marlboro. But I panicked. It happens, guys. I get another one, I'll show you it. Okay, we got a mega elixir. Alright, so go directly north onto the platform in the center, use the save point. Oh 
Okay, so we got a lot of bosses in here. This is gonna be, uh, well, we'll see. I keep saying nightmares, but it turns out that I'm better than I think I am. And, well. All right. Okay. All right. Okay, here we go. Uh, I'm, give me a second, I'll be right back. I wanna save and make sure that we're good to go here. All right, we're back. So we're going to go ahead and start this. So we're going to go fight Sid's boss first. Um, right side. Let's start with Sid's boss on the right side. Okay. Hope I get the right one. It's supposed to be the death machine. To approach me, must first test your strength and endure the trial. All right, we got the death machine. He has 50,000 life. Um, okay. Okay. So, which ones? We want to use Fyraga. Okay, so you attack. He's not really dangerous. Um, he has a lot of life, but beyond that, uh, he casts some things that automatically kill you, but... He's very slow attacking, so... Okay, why is this not working? So you want to cast Berserk on him. Alright. That's one of those. So, cast Phoenix down on him. Just curious. I want to analyze them. Just look at them. Because why not? Everyone needs life. Oh, that's an automatic death. We beat him. Caesar actually gained a level dead, and he obtained Thor's hammer. <laughs> All right. So we're going to equip that immediately. Holy crap. Holy crap. So we're not going to do anything because we're going to come over here and use another cottage. That was fun. I mean, that Thor's hammer is something else. Okay. So we're going to go to the left now. To approach, we must first test the strength. So this should be the Flan Master. 
I didn't name them. Okay. So, um, Perom needs to cast Haste on Rydia and Pelham. Then have her heal every round. Okay. So, that's fine. Uh, Rydia should summon Bahamut. And Palom should cast Quake. This guy has 35,000 life. Um, okay, so I think we're good. So, Quake. Okay, what are we doing with her? We're casting Haste on Rydia. Okay. Who is this? All right. And we'll just keep doing this until he's dead. one seems like he's actually easier than the other one because he d oh that might hurt yeah We're gonna go ahead and heal just because we can. And attack. Black magic, do another quake. And another summon. Got him. Alright. And this time we get Triton's Dagger. Which is, is, who was this? Was this Palom's boss? Yeah, this was Palom's boss. So Palom gets a new weapon. Wait. Okay, that's not as strong. I mean, it's strong for him, so that's a plus. All right, we're going to go after whose bots we're going to do next. We're going to do Perom's. Okay, that's cool. So we're going to come back here and we're going to do it again. We're going to we're going to go get another boss. So another cottage. Okay, so this one is where is this one? Uh Magic. We want float. All right. Where is it? It says northernmost. You must first test your strength. Yeah, we got this. All right, Tyrannosaurus. He has sixty thousand life. Um, you want to have float on this during this battle, uh, because he does a lot of earthquake. Uh, so Porm is going to cast Berserk on Cecil and Sid, and then cast Karaja when needed. Um, Riddier have Palom. Okay, so we don't want to do any counterattacks. Instead, have Riddier constantly cast Behemoth and Quake, or Flare if I happen. Okay, all right. So let's see. Do we have flare? We do have flare. Hi, guy. Okay. 
Oh, that was lovely. All right, so what are we doing? Uh, Berserk on Cecil and where's my Berserk? Okay, that'll take care of that. Come on, there we go. Summon Muhammad. Yeah, see that earthquake doesn't hit us because we're floating! Yay! I mean, why not? We'll just go ahead and cure because everyone's been hit a little bit. And this will be the last mini boss we fight here, or boss fight, because we've got to change parties. For some reason. I'm not really sure what the reason is, but we'll go with it. All right, that wasn't too bad. We got the Seraphim's Mace. Okay. So let's go to Perome. What do you got? Yeah, it's a little bit better. Ah, it heals. Cool. All right, so we're done here. So I'll see you guys next time. Adios, amigos.